What's up, everybody? After DJ Mac here with a quick Ableton Live tip on how to slice up your vocals. So a friend of mine was asking me of an easy way to chop up vocals um, rather than doing it here in the arrangement view. So I told him about Slice to MIDI, and I'm going to show you how to do that really quickly. Um, so right here, I have this little vocal part. And we're going to chop this up. So right now I'm gonna basically you can do it from the arrangement view or you can do it from the session view so you're just gonna right click that clip whatever it might be and go down to slice to new MIDI track um, you get to choose how you want it to slice you can do note divisions you can do transients or you can do warp markers I'm gonna do quarter notes for now and we're just gonna stick with this preset but there are many other presets which determine the kind of rack that Ableton will put your um, sliced up instrument into. So let's click OK. That, by the way, is a whole other story, but there are lots of cool options. You can make your own. And now that we're done here, um, we can sample what this sounds like. So I'm just going to record and enable it. So I got it right there. Um, and you can go in here and, and basically, you know, determine how you want these slices to appear. And, you know, like this one I just changed. Maybe we want this like little thing going on here. It's just a matter of moving these around for each individual one. Um, I have one here that I've already set up, so we're going to look at that one right now. So. So what I like doing this for is say you have a track here. You know, maybe you got your opening or something. You can kind of spice it up with the vocals that are going to come later. You know, not that that's the greatest example, but you get the idea. You can really chop things up and... It's a lot more fun for me to press buttons and perform vocal cuts than it is to chop them up and put them in here. Um, I, for me, I'd rather chop them up, slice to MIDI, do this, and then edit them later. Um, so that's a little tip for you. You can slice to MIDI anything, drum tracks, all sorts of stuff. Um, again, you just right click and select slice to MIDI. I am using the beta version of Ableton 9, and you will see there are some new options here, which are so incredible. Um, but that's for another time. I hope that uh, you find this little tip handy. And have fun slicing up vocals and all sorts of different audio stuff. Take care and enjoy.